We are the Contender Inc. and we provide reliable representation for all kinds of entertainers and athletes. Our most recent client, Michael Ray, had a roller coaster of a career. And we are here to provide insight on his ups and downs. So uh, here's Michael Ray. He uh, is a singer, songwriter, and music producer. Um, he's the lead singer and guitarist for a world touring band. He has smooth, rest, controversial lyrics, and a strong work ethic. Those talents got him a four year contract with Columbia Records. The deal was for $1.5 million with a $150,000 advance, along with a 3% of industry leader dealer price of albums. He also agreed to a tour sponsored by Live Nation worth about $3.5 million, along with uh, giving the rights to Live Nation for the DVD of the tour. Not only did Michael get a tour contract and endorsement deal, he also got an album endorsement with Spotify, which greatly helped promote his new album. Throughout the week, Michael had problems with the recording coming out of him making racist remarks. He tweeted apologies and visited many public radio and TV stations, along with working with organizations against racism. Michael also performed at the Grammys, which went very well, and really helped promote this album and make it much more popular. Another thing we did well as a team is our PR team did a great job covering up a uh, drug scandal that could have possibly threatened uh, his career and his uh, public image. Um, so what didn't go so well was our partnership with Ray-Ban. It started out strong, but once Live Nation stepped in and tried to sponsor our tour, we just couldn't handle both of the partnerships. Um, we also wanted Apple to endorse Michael with their new iPhone 6, but I guess our endorsement team lacked originality and creativity, and so we couldn't lock that deal in. Um, Michael also was asked to be in a GQ magazine spread, but because of other circumstances, we were unable to get him into the magazine. Um, our original contract to contract offer to Universal was declined, um, and so we had to settle for much less money, but we eventually did get a contract. Um, Michael has also been seen in the public eye as a womanizer going from girl to girl, um, and so that was a difficult situation that we had to try to cover up. We found after doing the simulation that there were things we as a group could all improve on, such as communicating with each other, so endorsements, talking more with the contracts, and uh, PR, just figuring out a good balance so we don't get all mixed up. Uh, we also found that we needed to be more aggressive with what we wanted and stop just saying what we would like to see, but what we want and need to see. Um, we also found that we lacked creativity with some of our endorsement ideas and how to get Michael's race image out there. Um, we also found that we struggled with our time management and getting things in at a certain deadline and also persuading the, uh, some people like the record labels or Ray Vance and Live Nation to work as a team on the two. 